These were the scenes in Hebron as PLO leader Yasser Arafat flew out to Tunis. As Palestinian youth pelted Israeli soldiers with stones and glass, their leader attempted to persuade his cabinet executive that peace in the West Bank is possible. Whether they agree or not, and there is widespread dissent, the peace accord is scheduled to be signed in Washington later this week. The critics, backed by people on the street, are giving Arafat a tough time. In the West Bank town of Nablus, where three Palestinians have been killed in the past week, demonstrators made their feelings known. They're impatient for a firm timetable for the withdrawal of Israeli troops from Palestinian cities like Hebron. It's one of the significant holes PLO ministers such as Saeed Raikat have identified. Until these problems are addressed, no one can give any guarantees.